Hello, my name is Jeff Neal, and I'm a member of the Vestry for Christ Church. Reverend Mark asked me to give my perspective to you today about why the church matters to me and how that may relate to my stewardship. Last week, our junior warden, Patricia Giannotti, talked about the importance of giving, and I want to continue that discussion from my perspective to honor God today and to give to his kingdom. As I reflect on most of this past year, I've often been reminded how my heart has been connected to God and to his work through Christ Church and many of our church members. I wanted to say thank you to Reverend Mark, <clears throat> Reverend David, Maggie O'Neill, Sally Farrell, and Bruce Adamy, and many more behind the scenes that impact not only myself and my family, but our church community, and just as important, the surrounding community on a regular basis. Their dedication to us and God has been a great example to teach my kids the importance of giving. To me, it's a spiritual matter. It's about loyalty and faithfulness. As I continue to reflect on our times, our stewardship today for this church is crucial for the impact for all of us in the future. In other words, it's our responsibility to take care of today for tomorrow. And that can come in many different forms of serving. As I continue to think of what I need to teach and show my kids about giving, I believe to give by faith means we put obedience to God above all other considerations and trust him to work it out. I've shared with you in the past that my mother, who's almost 90 years old, says something very similar. She likes to say, let go and let God. Faith means there will always be obstacles. And I believe we have seen our fair share in 2020 and most likely we'll see a bit more in 2021. That shouldn't stop us from serving and making this world a better place. However, with these obstacles, I've witnessed the many small blessings in my life, which has strengthened my belief that God, that given to God's kingdom and having faith, he will provide many gifts in return. I just need to slow down and see them. So as a member of the vestry, but more importantly, as a member of this church community, I'm asking if you would be compelled to be generous with your money, time, and skills. I believe this will help us as a church, members to live out faith in Jesus as a community. As I said earlier, I continue to find myself reflecting on times we are living in at this moment. I recognize that many of us have had a hard time in 2020, and it's required of us to have hard conversations and make big decisions, especially as we look towards 2021. What gives me peace and hope is that I know that God is at work in this church, and it's the collective gifts from all of us that allows this ministry to make a difference in our lives in this community. Thank you for your time and the opportunity to speak with you today.